It's an elephant tranquilizer called carfentanil. And recently, the Federal Drug Enforcement Agency issued a public alert about that drug. The awesome strength of that particular uh, synthetic opiate, uh, that just a, a tiny grain of that, that drug is sufficient to cause overdose and, and death. So far, however, the drug has surfaced in just three states, Kentucky, Michigan, and Ohio. In those states, it's been found laced in heroin and left a few dozen people dead. Some of these uh, death scenes that officers are going to, uh, and actually that I have been to some years ago, uh, the needle may still be in the person's arm or in their vein. If there's such a thing as a normal opiate overdose, that person can be revived with one dose of a drug called Narcan. Multiple administrations of naloxone may have to be given in order to revive the person, to get them breathing again. Synthetic drugs turning into street drugs is nothing new for Maine. So-called bath salts, uh, that was uh, a synthetic drug to mimic a stimulant, cocaine. Carfentanil has yet to appear in Maine. We cannot rule that out. Uh, we're, we're global. It seems to some cops, just as soon as they get a handle on one drug, another one pops onto the scene. The manufacturers of illicit drugs come up with a new formula. The DEA is warning cops and the public at large about carfentanil, but they're also warning emergency room medical personnel as carfentanil is just as deadly if it comes in contact with your skin. In Bangor, I'm TJ Tremble reporting for ABC7 and Fox 22.